Hello, anyone who may be watching now or later, Helene here along with... Rakir! And welcome back... Oh, no, not welcome back. <laughs> welcome to Orcs Must Die 3, a game we had been wanting to play for quite a while. But, yeah, issues with the game after its release just uh, push things back a lot. <laughs> yeah, at least it seems finally stable enough. Yeah, that, yeah, just the game was unstable after its release. And just putting this thing behind myself here, because I did find a pillow that does support my head somewhat, even with with the new uh, earphones on. <clears throat> okay, that's a lot better. So yeah, we we played through Orcs Must Die one and two with two together. Uh, on the main days previously, but with this one we decided to put it on the Saturday. Uh, but I still th I think we'll still get a good amount of streams out of this one. So, yeah, let's see. Uh, you've picked your character. One thing to note and that is visible on the side here is that I have played some of this game already. I have dodged the story as much as possible. Uh, but that there is one problem, and that is that where... In previous games, you could have separate profiles. We're not <clears throat> having a bit of an issue with my throat, apparently. Uh, where you could have separate progression. In this game, that is not the case, which is a slight count against it. But for the sake of yeah, <clears throat> for the sake of keeping things fair, I'll just keep a note of how many skulls and progress we have unlocked. Um, hmm. so, but, but it might be a bit more annoying with this because you can re you can refund all upgrades of your stuff, but you can't refund materials, or you can't re you can't unlock you can't relock things you've already unlocked before. So yeah, a lot of these things I'll just leave aside until we should have access to them. All right. But for now, uh, ready when you are. All right, let me click. Ready. And just double there check it. There we go. Maximilian is gone. No one knows where he is. He left the order, he left me, with these children. Born with the ability to use rift magic, Egan had no idea how powerful he was. Kelsey was the most studious novice in the order, but she lacked control. I had to test their capabilities. A real ogre would have eaten you by now. Sorry, Sorceress. You will wish for that fate what before long. I'm trying. Coming back. Wow, it's like you're allergic to saying smart stuff. Come, playtime is over. All right, let's see if I can get into somewhere I can adjust the volume. I even yeah, tried to. Strangling my mic with a towel. <laughs> uh, yeah, sorry for the bits of echo there. Uh, yeah, I'm not, yeah, not sure what to really say about that. Okay, same as all of the previous games. Uh, we, hmm? um, we're on the same counter. Oh, okay, oh, that oh I forgot. Definitely not an order rift. Yeah, we'll I fix that next one. That, but I did. You are correct, Kelsey. That rift is different. Okay. Quickly. Ooh, Where do I get the menu to volume? Can I still do with that here? Uh, options. Hear her when we can't see yeah, her? let's see here. Telepathy, genius. Sound. Yeah, let's try out these traps for real. 
But oh. yeah, we have our two characters, both of whom have a. Yeah. <clears throat> I can see it's a title! Okay. Okay. Uh, there's a. Like with Orcs Must Die 2, there are slight differences between our, the two characters that we have available to. Uh, Egan and. I've already forgotten the other one's <laughs> name because, yeah, we distracted with the echo problem. But yeah, Egan, he starts with the bow, and he has a movement ability that lets him to do a sort of ground pound. And the girl, she, she starts with the shot, or the blunderbuss, as her standard weapon. And when she would use her movement ability, she'd hover around. Uh, if you think that might be a bit odd to have the archer be the one that would be going up close with... And not the one with this blunderbuss... Yeah, that is something that people have uh, agreed on, apparently, because there there are some overhaul mods for this game out there that swap that around. But <clears throat> when I'm playing with Rakira, I'll just keep it to how it is normal, even if it seems like they got their wires crossed somewhat. Anyways, for now, let me unequip all of those. And then we'll just stick with the standards of the arrow uh, trap. And I think, I'm not sure if the tar trap was start at the start, but I do know that this one is. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I've reduced the voice volume and activated my subtitle, so I should hopefully be able to read. However, if Echo continues, means I will probably need to lower the master volume instead for the cutscenes. Or just finally get yourself a pair of headphones or earbuds. <laughs> So I, will, I will pay to get you some if needed. Oh, okay. I, I mean, you also have to ask my little... I will ask my little brother about it. Right. So right. we will probably look into it soon. Probably see if they, this, they still have them while we get myself a new, an extra monitor. Okay. What are we... Oh, uh. right. Almost forgot. <laughs> yeah, you can still build them during the... Uh, you can still build them during uh, the ma the round the, the waves. Well, yeah, you sure. can sell traps during waves. It's okay. I've read it up, and yeah, these ghosts show you the way that orcs would be taking towards the rift over there. So, yeah. Oh, I don't see the rift actually. What are this? That looks pretty. <laughs> Yeah, the graphics one in this gates. one have gone up a lot. Okay, I like the bow way more than the blunderbuss. Yeah, it's a lot more of a sniper thing. With one of the overhauls, uh, called one of the overhaul mods called the Green Tide, I do believe it gets a bit too powerful because it gets a massive headshot buff. And yeah, on the on the normal orcs. There will probably be too many to really make it that useful, but on the big enemies, it basically, won't, on most of them that I've seen, it one shot kills them. <laughs> so that is a bit too much. More enemies on the way. Uh, yeah, balance is always a bit of a, a troublesome thing. Yeah. I might even I might do some off schedule streams at times with that with uh, another friend who recently bought this game as well, and they really liked it, and they really liked the uh, overhaul mod as well. But I'll not speak. I'll try not to talk too much about that one. Okay. Can't put them there. And yeah, coins are gotten by getting kills. Uh, you get you get more coins if a, an orc is killed by uh, a multitude of if or if they are damaged by a multitude more of traps. And sometimes they will drop uh, pickups for coins. Uh, we rather want to. <laughs> we can shoot past the, the protective wall. That it basically makes them invulnerable. Or at least we can't pass through. But we can shoot through it and get kills on the other side, but we'd rather not because if they do drop coins or health or mana, they uh, 
Yeah, we kind of can't reach it. Oh, that. Bo has a subterranean. Go ahead. I thought I put the uh, other flame flag to be able to flick them across the into the lava. Is that the thing in the wall? And that still slows them down. Yeah, yes, I'm toasty. Now that's an orc stop. There we go. The bow has a secondary fire, which basically yeah, gives it split good. shot. I, it's useful for shooting into crowds, but I personally I think just normal fire does well enough with that. Yeah, you really you really need to fire into a bunch because it, like. Oh, okay, I didn't see it. I haven't seen it fire five before. Okay, so there's a stage to it. I thought that yep. at this point it was the max charge, and well, it's a bit difficult to aim when a shot isn't going down the middle. Wait, hold on, what's that on your face? <laughs> oh, well, it's pain. <laughs> All right. Oh, right, this. There you go. And I keep forgetting I need to press the G button as well. All right, let's yeah. see how this will go. I think not a single one of my shots there landed. Okay. Now, of course, if uh, if any of these orcs would reach the uh, rift, which is extremely unlikely on the first level, unless you it would cost are... us uh, rift points of the twenty at the top of the screen. Uh, next, uh, right of that, we have the wave counter. Uh, yeah, they, they already, like it said, this is the last wave of this mission already. And next to that is the mini map. And, well, it's a mini map. There is little that needs to be explained about that. Red dots are enemies. It's a good way to keep track of things when you are looking at a different, or if you're in a different area of the map. Because maps will get a lot bigger than this. A hell of a lot bigger, actually. Oh, you're this... doing the same dance! Yeah. <laughs> okay, we didn't get the par time on that, so we have access to four skulls. Noted. Over here we can see, yeah, just number of combos. Largest combo, largest kill streak. The par time, which we actually missed by only 11 seconds. Okay. Now, for security, we're going heading back to the campaign menu. Because this game does have some glitches still. Uh, oh, by the way, change your character now. Yeah, I can do that at the spell book here. Heroes, Kelsey. Okay, Let's and... do this thing! Okay, there are four more to unlock. And they're unlocked at the Order Temple level, or, or after. Let's see, we can search a bit through the place here. I'm not sure what would have unlocked here. Hmm. I think it might have been the tar uh, trap, but I'm not sure. And how, how did I get access to the walls and the spike wall? I never unlocked that. Hmm. Either way. I'm, I can just play it safe with just only a few traps. Uh, nope, not the. <laughs> almost pressed the wrong way. So. Yeah, well, let's play it safe with that. And here we can preview what sort of enemies we'll be facing. Just more light and medium orcs. You yeah, got a preview of the minimap. And that's that. You also have a leaderboard here. But that's of little concern to us. So, <laughs> yeah. Let's get in. Oh, the gravity pillar would have unlocked here. Lifts enemies up in the air depending on their weight and drops them. Not to use for if you'd ask me. Man, the sorceress is really tossing us into the deep end of the pool. Yeah, it's way more intense than the usual training sessions. This is not part of your training. There's something different about these new rifts. Every war mage in the Order is investigating. Finally, we get to be real heroes like Maximilian. I will settle for you two staying alive and keeping the orcs out of the rift. <laughs> Okay, on this map we're dealing with two entry points, one up here, one down there. Of course, on the map, mini map, 
And from the ghosts, you can see that they will only be entering from this one for now. So, yeah, we have a choke point down here that we could fill up. But, yeah, shall we just split? Shall we? Okay, the key is very obvious that they, they want to <laughs> put the traps up here. So let's do that as well, then. Yeah, you, I want that to be tactical. Yeah. As can, you can see, you? Kelsey can hover around, but it takes... Moving around like that takes mana, which is the blue bar underneath the health bar. Wait, which button and then is that? Uh, it's the, it's her movement ability, double jump. Yeah, try to double jump to do that. Your character does that smash, though. Which okay. presumably knocks back, yeah, not, knocks back orcs. I like it. Yeah. I, thought, I thought it was... I thought she was to have the Superman thing, and I would be the levitator one, for some reason. Yeah. <laughs> it, it would be more fitting with their weapon and personality. But, yeah, it swapped around. Maybe to try and force both characters to have a, a long and short range thing. Hmm. Either way, oh, I'm ready. And I am too. Oh, wrong button. <laughs> okay, with this hover you could just easily Enemies move between places, but if you run out over a pit, then uh, the yeah. Okay. Blunderbuss is, well, it's a shotgun, an auto shotgun. With the alt fire being an explosive grenade. Get up, fuck up. Let's use the ice. There we go. Good up close, but it has a reload after a certain amount of shots. Or you can't manually reload it though. Okay. Hmm. Put that there. And I'll put one there actually as well. Okay. Uh, I think you faced that one the wrong way. Alright? Yeah. The the arrow no, on top tells where it will be aimed. Actually no. The arrow tells you what a what it will go when it flips. Um, okay. We're waiting if we burn in the right direction I wanted to, towards the stairs. Where okay, they would it must be have been something that the overhaul did as well. Because I remember when playing with that other friend that the arrow was pointing the quote-unquote correct way. Yeah, though, I think it's uh, saying if, you, uh, the, if we flip that way and we burn the other way. Actually... Yeah, if you look at it uh, in the detail, one, the fire part is on the fire side, the arrow is on the flip side. Yeah, flames are also coming out of the sides though. Uh, yeah, ready up. And right. yeah, now they're coming from both sides. Yeah, at least we have a bit more sun protection on the other side. Yeah. The enemy oh, army you, is attacking on you, can't, front. you often can't uh, keep an eye on all areas that the orcs may be coming from. Here they come. So it's for some parts you'll have to return. Yeah, for some parts you'll have to rely on traps, at the very least weakening enemies on one side. What the? They're entering the rift. How did? How did you get past, or did they come from the other way? Possibly, and I just somehow made a rapid fire with, with the bow. Okay. Should be extra credit. And yeah, coming. Okay, they must they must have come from the other sides. I love traps. Okay, that's all I can do. Okay, we can just hover up here and <laughs> stir them from above. The melee ones can't reach us, and the ranged orcs will only appear later on. I'll put some spike traps over here in case they 
sneak past again somehow. Yeah. Okay, waiting on you. Actually, I'm gonna slight change over here. There we go. All right. Okay, here we go. More enemies on the way. Okay, so I'm coming from both. Three, four. Okay, four shots, then reload. Yeah, early on you can't fully entrust that the traps will keep all the orcs at bay. And well, part of the game is to just... Oh, that you have to interact with it as well. But it is possible to make some setups, or at least in the previous games, where orcs just hardly ever can, are able to pass by. Hmm. Let's put down a few of these just to see what they do, really. Actually, they put them down, actually. But I will trap them after the flare fires are done. Yeah, uh, if, if they are on top of the... Mm. Yeah, I'm unsure how that would interact with them hovering over it. It would probably be better to keep them in front of the fire. Yeah, uh, I'm good. At least now they... Both sides are a bit more shielded. Even though yep. one side has a lot more traps in it. Yep. Right, are you ready? Yeah. Just when you when you're ready with everything, just press ready. Easy. As is typical with games, you you can get headshot damage. But a blunderbuss is not going to be too great with that, since, well, the <laughs> shots are going everywhere. And, yeah, a lot of the traps have a reset timer. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> okay. Okay, so it doesn't just hold a single one in place. That would actually be good for keeping them busy. Yeah. And it's slowing down to force them to be a tightly packed and run into the more AOE working traps, like the fire trap here. Yeah. There, there, there. Final wave. Is, yeah, it, it, a trap is not going to be very useful when it's reloading. Some traps can be upgraded to reload faster, but not all of them. Oh, that one went flying. So yeah, you... You preferably want orcs to be bunched up a bunch. And that way you can get a lot more with explosives like that. Okay. More enemies in the rift. There we go. <laughs> and yeah, they do the same stupid dance. Okay, back to campaign. Only two skulls because we lost a bunch of points. So, six total. I'll have to recheck how, mi it many, how much it costs to unlock some of these. Oh, God. Look at the light orc. 
Yeah, they're a bit uh, derped. And here we'll get a new enemy. So, yeah. Six skulls. I could upgrade one thing with those. Um, yeah, as you can see, I've gotten a lot more skulls from <laughs> elsewhere or during the other play. Again, I'll try to avoid using too many new, yeah, already unlocked stuff. Also, the reason that we're going back to the campaign every time is because sometimes the game will glitch and uh, lock up on one of our ends. Upgrade some of my traps. Really don't know where this one came. Maybe it was unlocked automatically after one level, but I certainly didn't buy it. There we go. It, uh, slaps enemies with physical damage and throws them back depending on their size. It'd be fun to use, but not not unlocked for this at least. <laughs> Okay, here we get access to the tar trap. All right, before we get, I upgraded my so fire traps damage. I also upgraded the range of my ice traps. Wouldn't that mean? Yes, Kelsey. So they should reach further now. Master Cygnus, if he is still alive, but why would Master Cygnus open rifts for orcs to pass through from other worlds? I know rifts provide magic, but this magic is not a positive force. Keep the orcs at bay. I must travel elsewhere for answers. Great! We fight the bad guys, she takes a vacation. It's cool. Uh, yeah, that's the whole reason that uh, these rifts are here. Without these rifts connecting to the, the human world, or, well, the other world, since it's not only humans there. Uh, yeah, without them, there would be no magic in the other world. And, uh, yeah... That magic is helping a lot of uh, things, so people would rather fight off the orcs for eternity than, uh, yeah, get things to work otherwise. We only, now we have two doors here, right? Yeah. Trying to... Okay. <laughs> Trying to see where... Okay, yeah, here the ice traps would be damn good. It says upgrade the damn range. Oh, yeah. It reaches all over here, Helian, now. Okay. Right, so yeah, now we'll also get to deal with the kobolds. But, oh, I got extra stuff for... Oh, I got top traps now as well. Yeah. It's here, I'm gonna... And we'll, yeah. we'll look a bit more at upgrading stuff uh, a bit later. Once we've gone, once we've gotten to a point where we would have caught caught up to where I already was, otherwise. Okay. Right. Done. Now that's an orc stop, and I'm ready. Okay, you can actually zoom in by pressing the middle mouse button as well. Oh. Makes it a bit easier to snipe. And we can also just hold down the fire button to keep firing instead of just having to click every time. Okay, let's back up a little bit. We don't have more traps. Let's well put it to use. See? Hello. And yeah, the, the orcs will just beeline for the rift, but if you get too close, they'll go after you instead. And... Okay, one got the stupid ass stuck here. What? <laughs> okay. Incoming. More of these to thin them out, or at least weaken them. Oh. Man, these little dudes are so fast. Those are kobolds. They'll also set off our traps. 
Yeah, kobolds are annoying because often by the time that... Yeah, as you can see, they're a lot faster than the other orcs. Or they, but they aren't really orcs either. And that as well. They're, they're typically fast enough to dodge a trap if they're going sideways you know, through its you know, firing range. At least they are weak. Really glass cannony. Yeah, basically anything will hit and kill them with one hit. You can kite our the orcs a bit by getting their attention. Cash. And that's that done. Okay, now they'll be coming from this side as well. So, okay. I'm going to remove my traps from up here and put them in the choke points. So no matter where they come from, it, I don't think a tar trap here will do much good. <laughs> Not a single one when they can just walk around it. Don't worry, I will fix that. Uh, oh, you move them. Uh, I, 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 I can build more than one now. This will surprise them. Yeah, I think, I think putting it, yeah, things in the choke point will work better for now. That's the stuff. And yeah, so I, I can the remove Drakir's traps if needed. All right, I can move, remove these and move them over here. There. Okay, Come let's on, see here. Uh... Yeah, looking good. Okay, ready? Uh, let's see. Yes, I can put them here. So they burn the ones in the tar truck. Should be good. Yeah, the fire traps have a, a range of two blocks in front of it. Alright, let's see how this works. More enemies on the way! Enemies are attacking on another front! They breach another door! Here they come! Yeah, the orcs will just stammer out a bunch of nonsense from time to time as well. Kobolds. What, kobold? There are enemies <laughs> in our rift room! to put down three more I'm short of uh, coin. Uh, just short I'll remove this one then there we go that'll work here we go ready as always and now they'll be coming from more both sides Okay. When you zoom in, it does slow down 
your movement speed and your aiming speed a bit, it seems. traps it should be pretty <laughs> obvious what they do they slow down anything that walks into them and as such it makes them one of their best traps in the game like, well in the entire series <laughs> because if you can keep your enemies going through traps uh, to through traps corridors longer you can put a lot more damage into them as well Let's see, I always send coin away. There we go. Cobots will ignore you per as a target. So, yeah, you could partially ignore them to just let them run into the traps. They, but, yeah, there's a good chance that some of them might get past. Yeah, I'm pretty gonna struggle with this trap. Five flamers and nine tars. Some spikes and many arrows and eyes. There's even a cool board to struggle in here. Mostly just weakening them at this point to let them get killed on the traps. Or, well, to get them killed if the traps are on cooldown. And that's the last, that was the last one. Yeah, this one went smooth. Yeah. <laughs> I love how we dance. And that's a bot's band. Okay, another four skulls, ten total. Campaign. Okay, let's see. First level. Okay. Yep, yeah, now we're we adding for the hidden dock. And here we'll get introduced to the orc archers. Let's see. Hmm. Oh, we really should take a look at what it takes to how much it costs to unlock any of these. We won't be getting barricades just yet. Um, what else could I trap that I have? Honestly, I'll just actually no refund. Or and then I'd be one skull short of the second upgrade on that. So back down to six skulls. We can upgrade our weapons, even! Yeah. Nice! And I guess a bleed upgrade will be in order? In case you need something like an ogre? Uh, yeah, we'll get to those on the next mission. <laughs> See, I guess okay. I can... I can upgrade my spike just to do electric or magical attack. Okay. Magic attacks will come into play or into effect later. Since at the moment we're just dealing with yeah, light and medium orcs who will take standard damage from physical attacks. But the more armor something has, the, the less physical damage they will take. 
All right, then for now we're taking my spark traps less the smaller cooldown. I can upgrade mm. twice even. That much as well. And ready. See? Might as well make the spike traps a bit more useful. Uh, yeah. The healing trinket this time. So, do you think the sorceress will be back soon? <laughs> We're doing pretty well on our own. Hey, Kelsey. How do you know so much about rifts and the order? I study all the time, Egan. I'd like to know all the answers. Then tell me why glue doesn't stick to the inside of the tube. <laughs> what? My glue doesn't stick to the inside of the tube. That's because the inside of the tube has been... are made of a material that, well, it can't stick to. Or maybe... Hmm, maybe it's more because of oxidation. Anyway, we've got another map with two doors. Most of the maps will just have multiple entrances. Yeah, uh, though. Multiple parts. And the show point is a bit dangerously close to the rift. Yeah, so we'll, we will have to split off to fight on both sides. For now... Yeah, mm, first wave is over both here sides. I want to put that ice trap there since it reaches all the way over here. Okay. There you go. As well, that should uh, freeze them to give us time to shoot them down if needed. Actually, uh, let's see here. What could I put? Hmm. Oh, yeah, I'm ready. Yeah, if we had... If we had access to barricades already, we could block off some of these paths to force them through. But, yeah, once we wouldn't have unlocked those yet, so I'm not using those yet. And well, the player doesn't have access to them yet. Let's see here. I guess so. Alright, I guess this will do for now. Right, are you ready? Yeah. But when I've put down all my stuff I just hit ready. So we when you're done just press it so we yeah, we can get into the next uh, rounds. Enemies are preparing right, just to make sure. Okay. Hunters, they have pretty long range attacks. Yep. I remember from the simulations. Here they come. Yeah, orc archers, these guys will go, well, they will actively go after you, but if you are near enough for them to fire on, yeah, they'll take pot shots. So I just, just keep moving, and you should be able to dodge them, but just keep in mind that you don't run into any other orcs while you're doing that. Let's retreat to the traps, traps. We do have traps after all. Yeah, but we we have them pretty held back here already. Do we get more coin from them uh, dying in traps? Another win. Ooh, mm. that's a chunky amount of coin. And now they only come to the other side. Okay. Mm. So pretty much going to try and mirror. This one. We could set up everything in here, but then we could have a moment right there, but then we could have moments where there are too many orcs coming through at once. And yeah, we just get over we get overrun. I can't wait. This Let's do it. This is gonna be mean. If any orc stands on this, they will be flipped into the tar and possibly into the ice and the other fire trap. Am I thinking mm. too deep into this? Uh, it, it'll activate mostly for them being over here. But yeah, if it goes off with one on top, it will get thrown. Not very far, but it'll get thrown. All right, let's see. Oh, 
Another door is being attacked. They've breached another door. Love one around the corner, and I've got a bunch of them. Yeah, their secondary fires also take up mana, so you can't just continuously spam them. But you can still throw out quite a bunch of these like that. Yeah, and now they come from both sides. Uh, yeah. okay. Um, Kill that yeah, in. what should we do now? I, I kind of tend to put traps the, uh, in the middle here. No better hmm. place than this. Yeah, I'm going to keep things spread a bit, and beyond that, we should probably each cover one side. Yeah, but should I put some traps near the rift in case they get uh, past us? That's your choice. So I guess it's be best is to not let them get past in to, to begin with. Does this does this dock connect to anything at all actually? Because it seems to be pretty separated from the rocks over there. Yeah, no fall damage. Was there a bit of fall damage there? Because I think I saw the healing trinket kick in. Brains only take you so far. Here we go. Try, try again. And yeah, you can get knocked out, but it won't cost you any rift More points, but it will take you out way. a bit. Hmm. Okay, looking at OBS, there does seem to be some stuttering going on with their graphics, so we'll have to lower those after this. Yeah, I'll keep these busy. There. Maybe that'll help things a bit. Well. Now they're coming from the other side again. No, they're coming from both. Okay, one good way to deal with kobolds is to have a trap set off aimed towards the path that they're coming from. Because if they're running towards a trap, then they're going to get caught by it. There we go. Instantly moving into the next map. And I'll take this moment to... Not that. Graphics. Medium. Except... More there we go. On the way. One, three, three, two. Still looks good. Okay, left side. What the? 
bomb! You fucking blew me up! Hmm? You threw your bomb at me? No. And then one of your grenades landed next to me. Pretty sure I only fired them this towards the orcs. Other side again. I think you hit the stairs and it bounced back. They're entering the rift. Okay, losing some points. And I need a healing potion. Do I have that item? You can use the healing trinket, but it has quite a cooldown on it. I got automatic heal for some reason, but alright. Yeah, uh, right, you okay. finished the round. Oh! Did I have that kind of thing on the last game? Mm, not sure. But then again, most of the time we wouldn't weren't getting hit that often. Okay. Oh, oh I put some spike traps near there just in case now. Okay, that's about as much as I can put down now. Actually. Three. There, now we have a bit of cover here as well. Yeah, just and... in case. <laughs> All right, ready? Yeah, now's the time. Hmm. Yeah, a lot of orcs are walking past these traps no since we can't block way. places off yet. Sides. Cobalt says something off the traps. Other side again. Did it work safe like a movie theater floor or something? It's something. I didn't hear. Then I know the voice volume, so I can't hear them so easily enough. There we go. You also have the shotgun. You can use that to get too close. I don't actually, I, I have it unequipped on this character. And it seems that the smaller orcs bypass your arrow traps. Apparently they are too short. <laughs> okay, these should be the last. So how would orcs even know what a movie theater floor is? Or even what a movie theater is? That's a damn good question. Okay, last wave. May hope that hopefully be enough. Maybe because I haven't upgraded the weapons yet, but so far the bows seem feel stronger. But you can get some some headshots. Yeah, and I actually upgraded my bow to have some bleeding. No, they seem to I seem to have killed them way before the bleeding does anything. Oh, there's something up there, shiny. It might also have to do that the shot the blunderbuss has to reload every few shots. So the bow can put out more consistent damage. Oh. 
Damn it! Ow! And yeah, if they get close to her, the rift, they will just like, start ignoring you and go straight for it. Because that is their main goal, after all. Yep, both sides. Okay, right, left is done. There we go. What? What the? Someone's burned to a bone, so there. Okay, two scrolls. Eight available at the moment. Dark split stairs is next, and yeah, here we'll get introduced to the ogres. <laughs> Let's see, bow. Oh, let's upgrade its fire rain rate. Spend four skulls. That was just thing. Ogre just picked his ear, smelled it, when it tastes it smelled nasty, then he ate it. Let's see. Now I'll put some into the arrow trap for more damage, down to a single skull that I can use. Okay. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm gonna press ready. <laughs> there we go. Barricades. Yeah. I have consulted the archives. It is as I feared. We are not facing something new, but something very old. Oh, hi. Welcome back. We've just been killing orcs and stuff. No big deal. Okay, so what's the deal with these strange rifts? First, stop this next assault. Then I will tell you the tale. Okay. I'm, leaving, I'm letting some air out of the pillow at for a moment. Because for some reason, it fe starts feeling heated against my back after a bit. Hey? And also, I will let the, you the, be the barricade master. Yeah, li like it showed in the preview. Okay, yeah, this is better now. Uh, even though we made skip passes quick. Barricades can be used to guide orcs around. Like, for a moment, if I put one here, you'll see that the, the ghosts go around it. And if I block off an air, a route, they'll turn around and go the other way. But if you block off all... Uh, if you block off all the routes to the rift, then uh, they change tactics and just start attacking the barricades. So it is a lot better to uh, yeah, block off all but one route. So yeah. yeah. This will wait this will waste a lot of the time of one of the uh, <clears throat> from one of the doors and then they'll come over this way. If I put those barricades at the bottom here, they'd come they'd both come up this way at the same time. It would be a lot worse for us since, well, we could get overrun. Like has been happening a few times now. Yeah, do we? Do we have a short point or do they all have to go to the same path here? They have to go down the same path now. And we also have these teleporters ah. for easy up and down. Wonderful. So we don't have all to right. go all the way back up the stairs. Yeah, the traps are for you to put down. I'll focus mostly on the barricades. Yeah, let's see here. Okay, this one seems very long, which is perfect. That's the stuff. Ready to go. Uh, you don't have uh, enough money for tar pits, uh, do you? No. All right. The barricades start at 
a thousand coins and you only start with three thousand at the here or at the start here now that's an orc stop let's see what this would look now all right uh, wait got... here someone text me I'll have to reply to that one later. Okay. I have to say, so far, these new earphones are proving a lot better than the old pair. Uh, for one, because it, it, it connects near instantly. With the other, with the old ones, I had to wait like a minute before it could get a connection in. Hmm. Uh, my little brother asked me about the monitor. I just told them standard for you asking how big he, I wanted it to be. And I don't care for a huge smart monitor, and the care is good. And size doesn't be equal good, really. Yeah, it, it'll probably be best if it is the same resolution as your current one. Yeah. Yeah, I so for you. Oh, oh wait, you brought it on. Same problems. It's also about size. Okay, uh, so and then... Uh, just quick, yeah. a moment here. Okay. And I'll take a moment to look something up here. Not what I'm looking for there. Not that. Not that. There we go. That should be it. Okay, that's the list of Twitch bots. So, might as well live on the air go through the current people here. To see if they are bots or not. Uh, so just add an uh, exam for that. Uh... Basically, quality that fits my PC. He's he was he was the one that built my PC, and recommended me to get one that has uh, more FPS. So yeah, I was I was going to tell them standard on size, and I'll also ex 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 uh, text for uh, quality fitting my PC. Okay. Again, as as long as it's it have has the resolution thing fitting my PC, I happy. I, I don't think it's PC screen that's as big as a TV. Alright, let's see here. Enough delays. Okay, here they come, and they are starting Enemies right are off with the ogres. One of our gates. They've broken through. Whoa, that ogre seems bigger out here in the wild. And remember, if he hits you, he will stun you. Yeah, and they will also charge at you if you get close. <laughs> they see me rolling <laughs> down the stairs. Oh, we have roof traps. Yeah, and I believe these do reset. So, what? What hurt them? More. Yeah, they're not kidding around with how many enemies they throw at you with this. Oh, no, you, dro you dropped the other one on them, didn't you? Yeah. I, I do think they reset, but I'm not sure. I'll try to shoot the one further away and hit the one closer. No, I don't think they'll reset in the middle of a round, but I think they reset between. Okay, just shooting into the backs. Headshots for 
Oh, I'm trying for headshots to get more damage, of course. Archers are the biggest plane that we can deal with at the moment. Besides the ogre, but yeah, they are easy targets coming back down the stairs. <laughs> on or orc archers and okay they haven't respawned hmm. maybe uh, maybe that was part of the overhaul mod as well hmm. but now though it might be better to do yeah. this force them down a single path, so it'll be a lot easier to get them, or well, uh, for them to group up. All right, I adjust this trap here. Let her rip. Still feels like my shoulders are heating up for some reason with this thing. I'll let have a bit more. All right, what do you think of this? Uh, looks good. That's it? Not magnificent? Let's do this thing! Rude. We'll need a lot more trap yeah, types <laughs> to get to that description. <laughs> get back in your stupid thing. grenade working here very well yeah because they're a lot more bunched up because of the barricades <laughs> okay now they are getting through though because we both got distracted by a freaking <laughs> kobold There we go. Mm. And there, that'll focus them down the middle even more. Oh, I had just an evil idea. Hmm. I'm this one. <laughs> okay, and get started on slowing them down over here as well. Actually, might as well put that there. And okay, it seems that the, the bombs don't respawn, so that must have been a part of the overhaul mods. Yeah, looking good. Okay, this will be a good sniping spot. Technically, we could put down barricades at the bottom as well to slow them even more. But, uh, yeah, this will probably be best for now. With the barricades, yeah. you typically want to uh, work in the smaller areas, not the big ones. Yeah, they, um, you want most of them to force the orcs to move where you want them to be. And hello, Skull. At least we move, forcing them to move into our traps. Like, what the? I get it. You could ask nicely. Oh, crap. Yeah. Yeah, 
They try for headshots. Big or small, I can take them all down. Okay, now the opposite. Ogres and arches are the primary targets. Yeah, the ogres will be the biggest threat so far. Ow. There are enemies in our rift room. But that was close. Okay, some some kobolds ran past, I presume. Several, and I has got uh, killed them all on my last ammo. It went nowhere. <laughs> one, one useful thing about the archers standing still when they're firing is that they, <laughs> they'll stick around for when a, a trap is going off again. Okay. Uh, there. 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 More enemies okay. on the way. Okay, keep an eye on health. The barricade is under attack. Right. Oh. Yeah, they're. Enemy orcs will generally ignore the barricades unless their routes are completely blocked. But sometimes they can hit them in collateral damage. They're attacking the barricade. Like, I, I presume that I presume that damage is from an orc archer trying to shoot at us but missing. Yeah, well, he got stuck there for a moment. <laughs> that just fully abused that. Something I've accidentally sold there. Okay, Bond's going up the other side. Let me try sniping from here. I should be out of the range of this archers. We'll see once this guy gets in range. Or not. Oh, yeah, they can still shoot at me from all the way down there. Healed. Yeah. Hmm. Uh -huh. Put there. I could put right. down more barricades here, but for now, let's just fill this place up further still with traps. Oh, I feel like we can put extra traps down here now as well. It should probably be more like spike traps. Yeah. So let's move this one up for a bit. <clears throat> Pardon? Oh, give them. There you go. This looks like a nasty trap. <laughs> Yeah, uh, 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 quite a bit. Actually, yeah, this 
Actually, are we, are we moody, sir? For they seem to be rather useless over here. There you go. <laughs> Alright. More enemies on the way! Archers. Where are you going, huh? It can be a bit difficult to tell the archers apart from the rest, except for the fact that they stop. Uh, in the previous Orcs Must Die games, they were differently colored than the other Orcs, which made it a lot easier to spot them. Doing quite a good work. Uh, don't let up still still keep shooting into the branch. So you can lessen them up and Okay, that one was ignoring me for a bit. Yeah, now there's a lot of them coming in. I think you want to preserve the grenades for bigger bunches than just singles. I thought it was more behind the odor. <laughs> Oop, yeah. It's a bunch of them flying. There we go. Final wave. And yeah, we, we can't put traps on stairs like this. The best we could do is to put arrows on the side if there is room. Yeah, it, it may work on the ogres, uh, at least. Uh, let's see, I, I guess I can put some traps up here now. Yeah. No, those got stuck behind the barricade. Okay, I think we dealt with most of these sides. And now the... Yeah. That's my nose itching. Now we're, the rest are coming in. Why is my nose itching so much? <laughs> Extra coin. Yeah, grab the mullah. That'll cause some chaos. Bye -bye. And oh, wait, Pico. What are we dancing sing? Okay, four skulls. So back up to five. A plus two. We got that. Have a point. Yeah, because the next mission will be the first of the war scenarios. <laughs> the lava pits. Oh dear. Okay. Let's see. Seven points. Hmm. Four. 
I guess I'll take time to upgrade my current traps. Okay. Just made my barricades cheaper. And yeah, we'll be dealing with, well, for one, heavy orcs as well now, who have the most armor. And we'll also be encountering a boss orc. Oh dear. And also up top, you might notice something a bit off with the heroes. Oh? Because I'm when I'm, I'm up the top, I see Rune Lord Drakir Koa body, but you're not playing as uh, Egan again. You'll see why in a bit. All right, that's, it, it's already told me you it as Helian. Now the, the character next to it. Okay. Wait. I see the Egan for me. Okay. Ready up when you are. I'm ready. There we go. The story of Master Cygnus is known to all. Oh, Master Cygnus taught my hero, Maximilian. Uh, yes, he tried to teach your hero. He was my teacher as well. Didn't you turn evil for- Don't test me. Sorry, sorceress. What is not known is the story of his best friend, the elf, Vorwick. Human and elf fought side by side, the most talented war mages of the order. Before infighting forced the Horde into small factions, they used massive traps and defeated the largest orc armies. Cygnus and Vorwick were the best young war mages of their generation. But when their final test came, only one of them would pass. Cygnus, Starling Weapon, Chain Lightning Staff, Special Movement Ability, Feign Death. Then there's Forwick, who has the Elven sword, the Short Sword, and he can teleport around. And yeah, now that we're getting to war scenarios, we also get access to war machines and war traps. Mega Boom Barrel Launcher launches Mega Boom Barrels, deals physical damage, mountable war scenarios only. A giant flip trap flips large amount of enemies depending on their size. Yeah, this is where we'll be getting a lot of orcs. Here we are once again, friend Vorwick, fighting the largest orc armies ever assembled. I welcome it, friend Cygnus. I am curious about what drives the orcs. You must admit, they are far more willing to die for their cause than our own order mages. They're definitely stubborn. Or perhaps just stupid. Perhaps. Nonetheless, oh their numbers are no match for my strength and your knowledge of Rift. But I did it echo again? No. Good, then it, uh, but I did, it did work then. And now I see the swords. I saw this swords being an option. Yeah. I, 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 think, I, I think it, it gives a hint of the other characters, which means. That is a dwarf! Maybe. But it is a weapon literally called Dwarven Warhammer. Yeah, but that, that wasn't that in the previous games as well, or the previous game? Hey. No! There was a Dwarven Hand Cannon! Okay. Uh, yeah, we'll be facing a hell of a lot of orcs during this. And actually, I think... I'll sell a few of these. A lot of money. And yeah, the, the war 
The war traps are in their own category. This could stop an army. Okay. okay, just a bit short. If I had upgraded again, I probably would have been able to afford another one there. But oh well. Yeah, this is one of the big things of the war. Oh! What the? Hey! <laughs> yep. You can use some of the war machines. As you can see at the top right, I already unlocked two others, but I won't be using those. Road. Uh, let's see here. We have no good wall for the ice traps, do we? Nope. Yeah, out outside our trap the traps that we can use will be a lot limited and we can't put these things inside because well they're big freaking war machines. Uh you sit in, in an invisible chair. Yep. I'm actually this... phasing through the back of it a bit, but okay. They seriously did not put a damn chair on that? Oh, now you sit... Yeah, now you're sitting correctly. Now you're sitting in a chair. You were not earlier. You were sitting close next to the wheel. <laughs> okay. I should have screenshot that, but I, uh, really, I'm trying to figure out how I should put the rest of my traps. I have about 4k left here to use. Uh, you could put down... Uh, you should have access to the catapult and flip uh, flipper as well, so we could move things back. So you can put in another one of those. Uh, I, I feel like... oh, come on. Shift and number will select them. Oh. I uh, only notice now that we, <laughs> yes, we have access to those. Yeah, I was wondering where are they, and then I saw, oh, there. Okay, just put one down as well, and then I'll put up the barricades again. You could put one at the bottom of the stairs, but uh, some some orcs can survive as they get flung over. Uh, I'm playing, mm. playing the prison to lava. There you go. Okay. Mm, this might be a bit short. Hmm. Choice by the great Let's see. Things can get difficult to aim with these. Yep. I love this device. Since yeah, your your perspective is from these as well. Just, just, you can hop into that thing for a second if you want. Uh, this will surprise and them. these. These trebuchets, at least, or I, I think catapult would get yeah, catapult would be more accurate. There's only so far or so close that they can fire. Okay. So this might be well, a bit risky having it this close, but oh well. Yeah, I think I will save my money for the next round here. Okay. Let's see. And this will be you can afford more barricades here. Right. Okay. And I'm ready. I also forgot to check in the spell book for the amount of enemies. But yeah, already they're coming in a very large amount. Oh dear. It's like freaking Helm's Deep. <laughs> okay. 
You can t you can try this thing out on the next uh, wave if you want. Sure. <laughs> that never gets old. And luckily, these big ones don't go off immediately once one has set foot on it. Oh, I see you've upgraded your spikes with something. Magic. Yeah. yeah, these heavy armored orcs, they, they'll take less damage from the normal weapons. There, if the, or if the ogre blocked the flipper, because yeah, they're too big and heavy to get thrown completely. Keep the pressure on the choke points. <laughs> we should be safe. And some of them really sound like they are actively enjoying getting thrown. <laughs> okay, the end of the wave is coming up. Okay, the orc still gets thrown normally. It's just the ogre won't will just get tripped up instead of thrown. For the order, but I do win a lot. Hmm? Alright. Uh, Guess we should uh, move back the catapult as well uh, as we make more barricades. Yeah yeah, let's see. If if I put this here. And then some... Actually, maybe... I had it happen when I played with that other friend that if I, when I placed one here, some of the orcs could survive and land up on the courtyard up there. Oh! But only a rare few. Let's see. One, two, three. About five would it, it would cost to block that off. And with ice traps here. Okay. I will only put one though. We only serve as a bit of a yeah, forcing them to get damaged and uh, climb up. Uh, you know, get a bit tighter group. Okay, uh, should we move the catapult back? Yeah, I can move it over to the other side, or to the terrace here. It will give me less of a line of sight on the bridge. Uh, but I can still fire on top. I should still be able to fire onto it. A master's war machine. Mm, oh, there! You, you should have easier time to hit them before they get up on the wall, uh, on the bridge, I mean. Yeah. But I don't have sight on the choke point that we set up. Okay. I do still have more coin to work with, though. Hmm. This should work. Get there. Okay, you, you'll be in charge of the choke point, I'll be in charge of thinning the herd. Or the hordes. Yeah, <laughs> I kind of think I prefer that. Yeah. And hello there in the chat, uh, Enzwaldo. <laughs> good evening to you as well. Oh, good evening, sir! Okay. Let's see, I'm ready to go.
Yeah, I'm just gonna double check here, alright? Okay, alright, uh, oh, I can do this. There you go, and I'm ready. This will do for now, till we have more barricades. More enemies on the way! You also have... Uh, bo <clears throat> you also have uh, big pots of boiling oil, if needed. Uh, yeah, here they come again. Good at prepares an ice drop uh, next to one of them. This rock is blocking my sight a bit on how to aim. Okay, for now I'll just keep firing before the first uh, flipper, or launcher. You really don't need to do anything over here! Close. Yeah, I didn't do anything. We could set up maybe a choke point with some oil and with some tar traps at the bottom of the stairs. My trap cannot, my trap cannot over. It's a. I looked away for half a second there. Did, did the boom? Did the barrel that I launched just get hit? Hit by something in midair? Oop. And no, that one wasn't the survivor. Ah, heavy orcs. This should be fun. Do not take them for granted. They are a bit meaner than their smaller counterparts. Go here, Ogre! Ogre! Enemies are preparing to breach one of our gates. Okay, they are thinning out. Which makes it harder for me to hit a bunch of them. You can come over and hit me now. blow up at half a dozen. That's as much as I can do you now. Uh, you might want to check out the secondary on your uh, new swords, what they do. Oh, I forgot I had swords! <laughs> Uh, what is it it's supposed to do? Yeah, not sure. I haven't tried that out yet. Okay, extra skull here. So let's grab that. Okay, let's sell that for a second. And... Perhaps one, one of these. Two, three. Actually, no. There. There. Actually, hmm. I want to keep the flipper here. This could stop an army. Okay. Not sure how much good this might do here. Actually, probably better if I reverse that. Somewhat. Uh... There, now more will be forced to go over it. Very good. Can okay, we we'll put some extra traps over by the door gate for. Yeah, it's damage and. Yeah, might be good to uh, some extra stuff that to keep help me kill them off. Let's see. One of these here. Let's see. Mm. Here. Is there any more barricades you want to put up here? No, I improve. I put up some at the start here. 
to force more of them to go over the flipper instead of just walking over a corner of it. Uh, I could put down one more barricade here. Okay, there we go. Nice. That should help a bit. I'm not sure if the corners of this will help since they're going to take the quickest route to it. And thus they're going to mostly avoid the corner. Well, they do chase me at times, and when they abandon me, they probably run into this. But yeah, very safe and sorry. Let's there we see. go. Yeah, this gives me a better line of sight on everything. Still a bit of a blind spot uh, because of this rock, but I got better sight on the bridge. Alright, and are you ready? Yeah. Alright. Let's see then. More enemies on the way. Oh, I forgot to pick up a skull at the start. We'll get that after this wave. <laughs> Just a dozen of them gone there. <laughs> Itchy nose again. And here come a bunch of ogres. for any survivors that that was way on the shot still, <laughs> still got one of them is that there is a chance that some of the orcs that get launched from the flipper direct, directly ahead of me that the <laughs> might survive even if that batch just went straight into space and they could land up right next to me here which we'd rather not have. <laughs> this is the sounds. <laughs> uh. Okay, they just keep com <laughs> coming. <laughs> Oh, I got I got some of those in mid-flight. Okay, last of them is on the f uh, last of them are on the field, and that was a bit of a wasted shot. Okay, last patch incoming. Now we should be getting the last guy. And I forgot to uh, I forgot to adjust things at the start or show at the start, but we can also see the enemies that will be coming in the spell book, which will include a boss now. Oh yeah. And this guy is nasty because he disables traps. Wait, what? Yep. Uh, That's new! Motion commotion. Might have to check out what that is. Alright, uh, should we start making barricades over here as well? Uh, Where behind I the am? gates? Uh, oh, there. Um, yeah, might as well. Send them on the goose chase here as well. Very good. 
there. That'll give you more time to shoot into the, <laughs> the bunch of them. Okay. So, how might everyone in the chat be doing tonight? Um, actually, could, I probably should block this off, since they can get... Actually... Hmm. There is a side path here that is a single uh, path wide. It would be easy to block it off so that they can only go this way. But if you were to block this path off, they'd all have to go through a single file. But they would also get past me here. Or go past me here. Mm. Mm. But if we force them to go through here... They'll... Yeah, there's a, they can hit a lot more traps instead of being spread out over a bunch of them. Hmm. I guess we have to see about that for now. I hope this will work just enough. And yeah, we'll, we'll, we should get enough coin to block either side off if needed. And again, we won't be able to sell all of these traps. Let, yeah, let, let's just see how things go. Yeah. Because we still, <laughs> we still got one big ass catapult on our side. More enemies on the way. Might be a bit early that one. <laughs> still got a good bunch. Actually, if we had two of these, we could lay down a suppressive fire on these guys like continuously. Just keep bombarding the spawn point. So it might be probably be better if I just keep firing here instead of on yeah, at the, the bridge. Because they spread out after this. And again, it also takes the longest for the barrels to travel, so I'm missing a lot of them. <laughs> okay, that'll do for now. Yeah, There's a lot less travel time here. That was a wasted shot. Nope. <laughs> is getting thrown around up there. Oh, and one actually got thrown over the edge. <laughs> that doesn't happen a lot. Okay, the boss hasn't spawned yet. Okay. I think he should be showing up soon though. Bunch of ogres coming up your way. And where's the boss? Did he spawn and didn't get notified or something? I'm an elf with a gun. Wait. Did he get removed because I already killed him in the campaign or something? That was a part of the mod? No, he sh shouldn't. No, the character. Oh, oh, the one more wave. <laughs> that explains. Okay.
They'll be talking oh. about me for ages. Hmm? I did not know I could do that. Do what? Uh. Yeah, teleport. <laughs> I did say aloud earlier that his movement ability is teleport. I missed that. <laughs> and actually, yeah. I'm gonna do uh, something special now. I'm uh, gonna. Uh, let's see. Hey. This device. All right, I also place my own, but all right. <laughs> but you Ready? could use your money, your money on the barricades. Perfection. No, actually, is one catapult is enough, ain't it? Yeah, so far, but uh, you want to try it out for a bit? Uh, I guess I can try it out a little bit. Okay. Can make these traps extra deadly. Okay, just at the at the start, just keep firing on the entrance, and after that, uh, <clears throat> on the flip trap at the bottom of the stairs, or at the bottom of the bridge. And I see some money there. So, like I also showed, you know, read off at the start of the mission our characters you know, this my, this character <laughs> can play dead wait what yeah prove it uh, give me a sec while i collect the stuff over here let's begin Okay. What is that secondary attack supposed to do? Hey, I'm... I don't get it. Is it a charge attack? Maybe for more damage? I think you just launched something. Yeah, you're, you're <laughs> throwing. You're, you're basically doing Link's uh, beam sword stuff. So I am doing something then. I thought I was putting. Am I shooting something or not? Yeah, now I can yeah. see it. <laughs> okay, ready when you are. Yep, I'm ready. Would I? Will this actually travel More that far? On the way. Uh, are you not getting on to that thing? Ah, oh. our old friend Craig has shown up to fight. We should I forgot about that. He will disable the traps. Best aimed at the entrance or the, the bottom of this. <clears throat> the, yeah, bottom of the ridge. Yep, that'll be Oh, that's Crag. The biggest one of them is Crag, and he's leading at the front because he just disabled the first clipper. And now he's doing it for the second and third. So yeah, he is a priority target. And now he disabled all of the traps in this corridor. So... Got the, oh, I got hit just as he got frozen. They're breaking through. Oh, I, I think my shots are being blocked by the door. That's not good, of course. Ow. They've broken through a gate. I think you might want to come out that thing, or at least Here keep firing at the choke points because they're broken through. Well, that's the oh, 
Yeah, we're going to lose a bunch of points here. Where is it? There he is. Let's see if I can kill you because you are a high target. No. We only have half our rift points remaining. Okay. Well, we did lose a bunch, but at the very least, most of them did still get stopped. Right, I'll come over to now to help you. Oh well. Is Crack dead? Yeah, no, no he, he got through. And he, since he was a boss, he did, he did 10 points of damage. Yep. But we survived at least. An easy victory. <laughs> easy victory, he says. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, maybe I should not use the catapult in the future. <laughs> Probably should have given that to you at the start. Okay, Ice Amulet and Rift Lord unlocked. Rift Lord is difficulty, I think. And oh, I forgot. don't forget the bonus skulls. So 10 total available. And yeah, that is a war scenario. <laughs> what do you think? Awesome. <laughs> Okay, we are almost at the two hours, though. Yeah, it, it's not really worth starting anything on on four minutes. Hmm. It, uh, hmm. So yeah, that, that'll <laughs> that'll be it for the first time with this. The next level will be seven close quarters. Okay. Now let's see. Uh, here we'll get back. We'll get in reintroduced to the rock elementals. Okay. Here. Now, before we go though, I should probably see about. Actually, there is one thing I would probably want to buy for the next war scenario, but I'll probably yeah, this one, the rapid fire ballista. This one is quite good at close quarter, reasonably close quarters, and I think you'll probably like this one. But it'll be a bit more until the next war scenario, so we can save up, uh, so we can save up some skulls for that. Let's see, seven, eight, nine is the next war scenario. So yeah, as long as I keep uh, six skulls available until then, I can still upgrade something else. And again, it will leave me only four at the moment. Okay, I'll look at what else I'll grab, but for now, yeah, <laughs> it has taken quite a while before us to get to this, but I'd say it was worth it. Yeah, I feel like if we tried it earlier, it'd just be a lot of anger. Yeah, because the game still has some issues, because during the testing of this, you got stuck in the spell book in the middle of a uh, match. So, yeah. No oh. flawless, but still very good. And well, this yep. game is, is this game isn't full price like many of those other AAA, like, well, the other, this is, not sure if this counts as a AAA title, but it is at only 25 euros on Steam, which is a lot cheaper than a lot of other games. Which, well, all of the news around Battlefield 2042 uh, should say how low the quality of a quote-unquote triple A game can be, because that game was, yeah. that game is just broken, and it, from what I've heard, it's like over half of its player base is already fucked off because, yeah, they they <laughs> they they basically ruined the game. Yeah, I think I think I heard it. Let's see here. Both common uh, first shooter games, we both Call of Duty and Battlefield recently have really missed the mark. And uh, one yeah. of them even got the title of Worst Game on Steam. 
I think it was the mm. one you said that has gone uh, the, the, the sort of uh, one of the ten worst games on Steam on yeah, worst reviews. Yeah, either I'd say either the developers have lost complete touch with oh, that's the timer going off. Either the developers have lost, completely lost touch of what a good game you know, is or how to make one, um, or just. Yeah, EA is forcing them to shovel out shit. Yeah. You know, it could also be the third option, like similar to what happened with Infinity Ward after Modern Warfare 2. Is that basically all of the old developers were fired and yeah, replaced with new talents with yeah, no experience or little experience. So that only the name of the company is the same, even though the people behind the name are no longer there. Oh, that, that's I'm not, not sure on that. <clears throat> For now, though, uh, let's see it. Okay. Uh, thank you for watching, Enzualdo, and anyone else who has been uh, may have been watching now or later. Uh, there, there are there are a reasonable amount of names in the chat according to the chat program that I have running, but yeah, I, I'll have to sort out the bots from that because. Sadly, most of the people, no, most of the people, most of the uh, names in the uh, over there have been bots lately. So I'll just go through those and ban the bots, and we'll see what remains. Uh, yeah. Anyways, uh, thank you for watching. If is it now or later? And thank you especially, Edric here. Oh, you're most welcome, my friend. Uh, tomorrow, no stream because of a scheduling error. I. I'd agreed to something, but I, th which I thought was on Saturday, uh, earlier in the day, not during streaming time, but it turns out it was on f Sunday, due to a miscommunication around the time that I would have been streaming something Sunday. So yeah, we'll be doing that on Monday instead, and Tuesday and Thursday we'll be continuing with the with Darksiders 2, hopefully with the game a lot more optimized now. I did... I'll have to run a bit of a test with it. Uh, maybe I'll run a bit short test stream, but other than that, uh, we'll have to see how things go. Alright. Uh, yeah. As always though, until then, have a nice day, and until then. Be safe folks, and watch out for seagulls. And flying works. <laughs>